Ukraine's military intelligence agency has recently acquired upgraded UJ-26 Bober long-range drones capable of manual operator control, marking a significant advancement in their drone warfare capabilities. The Defense Intelligence Unit, DAU, unveiled footage showcasing this latest drone variant. Manufactured by Akerjet, the updated UJ-26 Bober is now equipped with a thermal imaging system and an undisclosed communications module. This setup ensures a robust data link that delivers real-time video feeds up until the drone strikes its target. Previously, similar image quality was noted during operations by the Ghost Unit, where Russian military bloggers claimed the use of drone aircraft integrated with Starlink satellite terminals. The new video reveals that despite the crisp thermal visuals, the drone's maneuverability remains somewhat sluggish, hinting at latency issues in signal transmission, likely caused by satellite communication delays. In the notable attack on the Sakai airfield in Crimea, the drone operated within half its maximum range, suggesting the potential for a heavier warhead than the standard 20kg explosive typically carried. The launch method has also evolved. The UJ-26 Bober now takes off from a catapult rather than a traditional runway. While this requires a sizable launcher setup, it allows for the removal of landing gear, enhancing aerodynamic efficiency and extending operational range. However, launching large drone swarms poses challenges, as each drone must be carefully mounted on the launcher, consuming significant time. One theoretical workaround is to coordinate multiple drones already airborne, though this approach carries its own set of complications. The emergence of the enhanced UJ-26 Bober alongside Russia's deployment of Iranian Shahid-236 drones signals a shift in modern aerial combat. Increasing production of heavy, long-distance drones is pushing warfare from strategic, large-scale strikes toward tactical use, targeting isolated enemy units deep behind front lines. For instance, the Russian Defense Ministry recently released footage showing a Shahid drone being manually directed at frontline positions near Kramatorsk. These drones, armed with reinforced warheads, are replacing traditional Russian artillery strikes such as those from Tornado-S multiple rocket launchers or Iskander ballistic missiles. Earlier analysis by Militarni I thoroughly examined wreckage from the Shahid-236 and cross-referenced its specs with confidential information on Russian-Iranian military collaboration.